hello guys uh, welcome to programming knowledge uh, in the previous video we learned about uh, how to create a, a basic window and providing image to it providing multiple widgets that is and a combo box entry widgets labels and buttons etc so i'll just show you the output of it and we'll move on to the next one so this is what we have looked in the previous video so if you are not familiar with it go ahead and check that out first or else you'll be lost so in this video we'll be looking into checkboxes radio buttons and uh, uh, the kinter message box so let's dive into it so for message box we'll just type in uh, kinter sorry mm, import kinter message box one minute okay so kinder dot message box so it appeared and what will be do uh, so okay so this is how you can import a message box and let's create some check boxes and radio buttons right so for that you will have to create two more um, um, labels that is for gender and the language so we'll just dive into it one minute so so for the label fourth we'll be using okay we'll just type in over here so use this label copy and paste and rename it as a programming language language and uh, place it somewhere like around 95 and 420 D right now we'll be using another label so paste it that again and we'll be using as a gender for radio buttons and uh, we'll also place that somewhere different so for 59 maybe and uh, okay so let's see what is the output okay so it is a bit messed over here so as you can see the buttons are overlapping okay so we'll look into that first so what we'll do over here is that we'll be changing the position of the button so we'll just move down and uh, change the position of the buttons so we'll just change five one five that is 130 and uh, 515 and 280 I guess this should work so now the buttons have gone a bit down and we'll have to arrange the programming language label okay so on the label okay mm, for the programming language okay so 95 right mm, we'll just change it around how about 85 maybe i guess uh, let's check 87 and uh, let's rerun this so as you can see it is a bit aligned but we have to place it in the perfect position so let's check 80 okay now it looks a bit better so okay so labels are done and the buttons are placed at a good position so let's dive into creating the widgets right so for creating widgets create a variable c1 is equal to uh, check button method of kinter root comma text 
is equal to uh, provide Java comma the variable that which will be using is equal to C var C1 so for the check button one right underscore C1 being more specific it is good or else it can get a bit messed up dot place so place x is equal to 235 and y is equal to uh, 2 uh, 420 right okay let's see whether it works or not save and rerun this so i guess there is no output see i don't know what is the issue with this okay so there is some some error so the variable c1 is showing an error okay so as we have done before just mention it over here so where underscore c1 is equal to a string where right now it will work i guess okay so as you can see this is a checkbox for the java okay now we'll create another one for python okay okay let's go down a bit so copy this one paste and change the text python change another c2 and of course change the position or else it will be disoriented 90 and 420 will be good and uh, we'll go top at the top and mention the c2 one right var c2 is equal to the string variable okay so this is the same as the entry widgets we'll just fetch out or get the check uh, box we are using save so these are the check boxes okay now we'll just get into the radio button for the gender so for radio button r1 is equal to the radio button root and uh, we'll just provide a text to it is equal to mail comma and uh, a variable for it too so reable is equal to radio underscore where and uh, we'll be using font or we don't require font just to provide a variable for it so here the value uh, a argument will be using a argument called as value so what Ever value you put into the radio button it will be used as an object for example if you want a value as a male so you need to pass it as a string so value is equal to mention it as a string okay comma sorry dot place and same as x is equal to uh, 230 comma y is equal to 420 okay we'll do the same for
the female one and uh, female just change it over here r2 we have to change it over here too so the value for that will be female and place it like around uh, 90 and uh, 60 around 60 right okay that's good and uh, we'll be using this variable radio var like we done for the check boxes radio var and mentioning mentioning sorry is mention it at the top so we'll be seeing like uh, let's go to the top and uh, we'll be providing it over here sorry so radio underscore where is equal to a string right so for the check boxes what i've noticed is that we don't need to um, use the get method but eventually we'll be using that but for that we have only two specific one that is java and python so just mention it it will be better so for the var c1 we are using java and uh, for the c2 we are using python right okay so let's print out that also print the uh, language which we'll be using so just before that create a variable var is equal to sorry var3 is equal to var underscore c1 right so we are getting c1 but we don't have to use you can use it based on your preference but here c1 is already provided java and c2 is also provided as python so you don't need to get it the value is java and python so that and uh, for where so that's i guess that's for where three again and where c2 for the python okay so okay so print that too so what we'll do over here is that we'll just pass three probe language is and uh, for that for the um, gender we'll be using your gender is and sorry we have not used another variable for the radio button but we'll be using as var 4 is equal to um, radio dot var dot get okay so it looks good and we'll be changing it over here as 4 so so this is the code and let's see what is the output okay so the gender is for the male is missing so let's check that out first okay 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 what is the issue over here so i guess there is some kind of placing issue but i can't see one and
ओके ओके आई गार्ड दिस बट हाँ ओके सो फॉर द रेडियो बटन मेल वी आर ओवरलैपिंग इट आई गेस सो इट इज विद टू थर्टी एंड टू सिक्सटी आई गेस ओके सो विल जस्ट प्रोवाइड दिस एज टू सिक्सटी एंड री रन दिस ओके नाउ दैट लुक्स गुड ओके सो दैट लुक्स गुड एंड यप इट लुक्स गुड सो नाउ विल जस्ट ओके सो नाउ विल जस्ट शू द शो द आउटपुट वेदर वॉट इट प्रिंट्स on the console so demo score user provide some random digit for the date select the country this python mail so there is no output and the sorry though there is no error and the output is been printed so your gender is male the programming language is python as we have selected so first name demo user concatenation the date of birth is this the country is this from the combo box programming language is python and the gender is male on clicking the sign up button so so for this and we have one more thing left that is the message box right so for the message box you just need to type in um, the method that is kinder dot message box dot show info not error info right and provide a title welcome Come, comma, user. That is also a string, so mention it into a string. User is successfully signed up. Close it, and let's see what is the output again. so this is how you can provide a kinter message box and it will be more clear when the output is shown so we'll be using another variable so user name sorry name provide some random digit select the country python female and uh, let's see sign up so this is a kinter message box so as you can see what we have provided over here that is uh, this first argument is the title sorry sorry for the spelling mistake but it is okay but the purpose has been served this is the title and this is the user content so user is successfully signed up okay and uh, this is the printed output from the widgets so in this video we have learned about the message box kinter message box showing an output uh, into it and uh, how you can use a radio buttons and check box within the kinter window so this is it for this video guys and thanks for watching